a father hen of pin, a state park here in Isle, Minnesota. So we are getting in some fall kayaking today. We are getting our kayaks out here on Mille Lacs Lake big 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 lake here and we're lucky because it is pretty calm for this lake check that out and for fall time it's even better so the colors are so lit up up here so we're so excited to get on the water today for some kayaking and then we're going to do a little hiking here and yeah enjoy this beautiful day it is october 4th so happy october to all of you it is officially fall time in minnesota and we have to take advantage so we're going to get our kayaks going here and get on the water So we are at the boat access area of the park, which is by the Lakeview Campground. Nice docks here to launch in and head out on the water. All right, you guys, we are on the water here. Oh. Oh my gosh, my lax is beautiful today. 48 degrees this morning. It is chilly. The mittens are out. We got the hat on, some hot coffee, and this is amazing. We weren't quite sure if we were going to be able to get out today because of the weather, but gosh, we got lucky. It is absolutely stunning out. So enjoying these last few days on the water because we know they are limited. <laughs> Our line here is just so pretty with these rocks. It goes all the way into the water. So this summer we were so lucky to get out on some really awesome kayaking on Lake Superior, which was the largest body of water we've ever kayaked. And now I would say Mille Lacs is second. I, out of all the places I went kayaking, I don't think we have kayaked um, any bodies of water that are larger than Lake Superior and now Mille Lacs. Stay extra cozy here on the lake this morning when it's, you know, 48 degrees. <laughs> I got myself a blanket here all wrapped up and it is super cozy, so that's how we roll when we fall kayak. <laughs> So leaves are definitely starting to drop here the first weekend of October, but there's still quite a few on there to make it really beautiful out. Wow. Such a pretty shoreline. Look at that. So pretty. Lacks Lake with our kayaks. Last time we were out here, we were in our ice fishing house. Yep. Catching what? Perch? Walleye. Walleye and perch. Perch are our favorite. So this is a state park that we have never really spent a lot of time in. So we're really excited to like do some hiking here. There isn't like a ton of trails, but it's like we're really lazy today. <laughs> and mellow. And we're like, we don't want to do a lot. We just want to like float around on the lake. We're up late. Just do a little hiking. Yeah, we had a baby shower last night. So we were up kind of late. Um, we had a baby shower and a 40th birthday party. So it's a late night. So we're just kind of chill today. So we're enjoying the uh, peacefulness right here and lucky to have such beautiful calm waters and sunshine so sunshine is warm and that definitely helps right because <laughs> if there wasn't sunshine I wouldn't be out here because it would be chilly <laughs> so happy first weekend of October cheers <laughs> out the clarity of this water underneath it is straight sand oh my gosh if it wasn't fall time I'd probably hop on in here <laughs> if it was a hot sunny summer day I have to keep this in mind it's really nice there is the pretty sand beach here at the park obviously no one's swimming but it is a really nice beach here they have at the state park it's all sand and as you saw earlier <laughs> in the, the water is all sand too all right 
we just banged up here on the beach area, just kind of stretching our legs and then probably turn around and head back. But yeah, such a pretty beach. Look at that. <laughs> Gonna be making the turn back to the boat access. So we did about two miles round trip. So we started from the Lakeview campground and went all the way over to the beach area. And that was absolutely perfect. The wind was in our favor today, so that's always a good thing. So now time to get the kayak sort of back up and do some hiking. So we are parked here at like the beach parking lot area and we are gonna hike to Pope Point. So it's about one mile round trip. Here is the beach area we were just kayaking in front of. Nice picnic tables. Map of the state park here. So we are right here and then we are gonna hike all the way out here to Pole Point and back. So one mile round trip. Oh, this is a really nice trail. Look at that, nice and wide, and the leaves are on the ground, and it just goes right along Mille Lacs Lake. So we got some really pretty views all the way. Whew, wow, it's nice out. few weekends we've been up on the North Shore. Oh my goodness, it was so busy up there. Everyone's, you know, getting into fall colors. And there's like no one here at Father Hannah Pit. It's so it's nice. peaceful and relaxing. It's like such a different mood just because we're so chill today too. It's like perfect. So I'm digging this this vibe this weekend. Easy hiking. <laughs> Easy hiking. <laughs> Beautiful kayaking. Sometimes it's okay to not go where everyone else is. We made it to Pole Point. <laughs> Pretty. Pretty views of the Lake Mille Lacs. All right, well that was cool. We made it all the way out to Pole Point. But now I think we're gonna head into aisle and get some food. Starving. We're starving. Get some good food and yeah. We have a bar in mind. We're hoping that they're open for dine-in. So we'll see. Routine, what we gotta do before we leave. <laughs> Downtown Isle, Minnesota. Where we're going, Beckham's Bar. Cute. Amazing, amazing lunch. Highly recommend Beckman's. That was awesome. And right next door, we can go get some ice cream. Cute. Chocolate shake and a sundae. Nice. Ooh. Guys, this is the creamiest malt I've ever had in my life. It is so good. Like, the best malt. you guys and that is wrap here at father hennepin state park in isle minnesota this was really nice so zen. exactly what, yeah zen it was zen it was a zen day at the state park <laughs> totally our mood too so it all worked out but thank you guys so much for watching if you have any questions of course let me know down in the comments below and if you haven't already be sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe for future vlogs we'll see you guys in the next vlog bye guys